Hi kids and parents. Um, this book that we are going to read um, is Who's in the Zoo, which we would have been doing during the zoo themed week at school. Um, these books I found on Teachers Pay Teachers. They are written by Amanda Schomburg. Um, her store is Panda Speech. Um, it's super fun. I do these in the individual therapy sessions and then I also do these in the whole group language with the entire class, no matter if they're working on specific language goals or just part of the class. Um, these books also come along with some paper questions that we are going to do, um, and so I'll do this in the next video and send you guys an attachment of this to work on with your kids, which you can either do it with your kids, do it after you play this, um, book that is read, um, or you can play along with me, doesn't matter, up to you. So, let's get started. Who's in the zoo? Zane, the zookeeper, put the, all of the animals in the cages for the night, but he forgot to put their labels on the cages, so now he doesn't remember who is in which cage. We have to go help him. Are you ready? Our very first clue. This animal likes to eat bananas. He likes to swing from the trees. And he says, ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Who do you think it could be? Does an elephant say, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, and eat bananas and swing from the trees? No. Does a monkey eat bananas? Yeah. Does he swing from the trees? Mm-hmm. And does he say, ooh, ooh, ah, ah? I think so. <gasps> we found the monkey. We need to put his label on the front of the cage. Next page. This animal is big and scaly and green. You have to be careful of his sharp teeth because he's kind of mean. Hmm. Let's see. What about a zebra? Is a zebra big? Is he scaly? Is he green? No, not the zebra. What about the alligator? Is he big? Is he scaly? Is he green? Is he kind of mean with sharp teeth? We found the alligator! We need to put the label on the front of the cage. This animal has a mane and he's a big cat. He's the king of the jungle. Let's not forget that. Hmm. I want you guys to think. Who has a mane, which is hair around their head, and he's a big cat. Do you think it would be a lion? Lion! We found the lion! Now we need to put his label on the front of his cage. Our fourth animal. This animal is gray and tough. He has a big horn and can be very rough. Let's take a look. 
We have zebra, snake, rhino, elephant, and panda left. We are looking for a gray animal who has a horn and can be kind of rough. Do you think you know? It's a rhino! We found the rhino! Let's put the rhino on the front of the cage. <gasps> okay, our fifth animal. This animal slithers through the grass on his tummy. He hisses and thinks that mice are yummy. Hmm. Does an elephant slither on his tummy? No, it can't be an elephant. Let's see, what about a snake? Does a snake slither and hiss? Let's put his label on the front of his cage. Alright, our next one. <gasps> this animal is so big, he could knock over a tree. It has a long trunk. What could it be? Zebra? Elephant? Panda. Hmm. A long trunk. You could knock over a tree. Elephant! We found the elephant. Let's put his label on the front of his cage. Getting towards the end, this animal is a black and white bear. He loves to eat bamboo, but don't ask him to share. Hmm, black and white. A zebra is black and white, but a zebra a bear? No, a panda. A panda is black and white. Is he a bear? We found a panda! Let's put his label on the front of his cage. All right, our very last one. <gasps> this animal looks like a horse. The main difference, he has stripes, of course. Hmm. Zebra or lion? Which one has stripes and looks like a horse? Zebra? We found a zebra. Let's put his label on the front of his cage. <gasps> Ugh. We put all of the animals back in the cages. Let's look. Hmm. Does he look happy or sad? He looks pretty happy that he finished his job for the night. 
All right, now it's time for us to do our questions. 